Frau Präsident. Madam President, I voted in favour of this report because I think it provides a usable instrument to stave off the attempts on the part of the Czechs to get hold of special rules applying to them. Unfortunately, they've succeeded this, with this getting the criminal Benesch decrees into the EU. So the international law and human rights are being declared inapplicable on Czech territory as far as people who were driven out of their homes is concerned. This was a genuine genocide. After the end of the Second World War, this took place in the Czech Republic, with several millions of people being driven out of their homes and murdered. This cannot be accepted. In the European Union today, there can be no nation which does not recognize its historical guilt, and the Czech Parliament should at long last take on board its historical responsibility and acknowledge that in relation to these displaced people. For 800 years, those, dis those people who were driven out contributed to the prosperity of that country. Thank you. Mr. Hannan's not in the chamber, so we move on to Mr. Posselt. Thank you. Um, the Austrian, an Austrian writer wrote a wonderful book, uh, The Little Spirit. Um, we have chased out a great spirit today, the phantom, the phantom of the Klaus Clause, as it's known, which for nationalistic uh, reasons and 